Are you worried that every little tickle in your throat might be the first signs of a deadly disease? Do you always check your symptoms on the internet to get a diagnosis? Your health anxiety, a condition that used to be known as hypochondria, may in fact have worsened during the COVID-19 pandemic. Ursula Perry reports it's been rising all year, but a local expert has ideas on ways to combat it. The coronavirus headlines can make anyone uneasy. But also concern tonight with cases now up in at least 10 percent. Health experts warn the U.S. is at risk of losing its progress against the virus. But if you have health anxiety, the grim statistics can send your worries into overdrive. With health anxiety, healthy patients fret, panic and obsess over medical concerns. Despite your efforts at self-talk and whatever else you do, you can't get rid of it. If your symptoms interfere with your ability to think, perform everyday activities or sleep, it's a good idea to seek medical help. Medications and therapy can help. Far and away, the best treatment for anxiety disorders are therapies like cognitive behavioral therapy or desensitization therapy. Some other tips? Steer clear of sensationalized media coverage. Instead, get your information directly from sources like the CDC or the World Health Organization. Avoid Googling your symptoms to self-diagnose. Try meditation, yoga, exercise, or some other healthy distractions to redirect that energy. Also, avoid caffeine, alcohol, and nicotine. They can trigger your episodes. And go easy on yourself. Battling anxiety, especially during an extended pandemic, is particularly difficult. Some experts are saying that about 12% of the population is suffering from health anxiety right now. And unlike other disorders, it seems as though men and women both suffer from it about the same amount. Ursula Perry, KSAT 12 News.